All right, so let's talk about like uh, how the name came up. Like how you come up with the name for your store? Well, hey, football was my passion, dog. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? As you can see, I got the the flow made like a football field. Uh -huh. So, you know that that would definitely inspire me to come up with the name Touchdown. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, the kicks and fits, of course, you know that just came on in because I knew what I wanted to sell. Yeah. But that that definitely was a major influence was football. What's like your main demographic? Like who you say mainly come in? I know it was like some white people that came in earlier, so it's not really like a set. No, this ain't but. this ain't urban, this ain't suburban, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. This ain't two different categories, this yeah. unity, you feel yeah. me? So but to be for real though, my basic clientele, my main clientele has been the white, you know, the yeah. white the white race, you know what I mean? But at the same time though, the brothers do come through. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate everybody that shop. Yeah. You know, so it's just a lot of people that still ain't informed of me being here. Like yeah. really don't know that I'm here yet. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So once we can get the word out a little bit more, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I have all all races, you know what I mean? It don't yeah. matter. I don't care who you is, bro. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Straight, gay, whatever. Yeah. You come in, you know what yeah. I mean? So everybody accept it here. It's this business. We handling exactly. business. Exactly. That's so, a crazy thing. Up. Everybody likes shoes, it don't matter what color you is, different sports or whatever. whatever. Your background, everybody like clothes and shoes. Yeah, so. man. I even had um Shaquilla Thomas. Okay. She had came. She came through, man, um, and bought some sneakers. She uh, played W uh, the WNBA yeah. over there in uh, in uh, France. Uh huh. She was over. She came from France, flew in to come home, which she originally from Chicago. That's what's up. I ain't even yeah, man. She came and uh, she had purchased some sneakers from me and everything, bro. So, you know, like I said, that that's major to me because you was all the way over there. You took a picture with her. I got pictures with okay. him, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. yeah, we definitely got pictures in here. I got got it posted on my Twitter. It's posted yeah. on my IG, stuff like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully we can reel in some more big name people because yeah. basically I'm just really trying to get people to come in and check some out, to yeah. see some. Because eventually I'm really going to host use this right here to host my podcast in. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? That's you know, we're so. just trying to get out there. For That's sure. it. For sure. What do you use to pick... Do you sell whatever comes out, or what do you use to pick what inventory that you're going to sell? Like, how do you do that? Well, what I do is, man, basically, like, every day I, every day I come with a different game plan, honestly. Mm -hmm. It's really a, you know, split second type yeah. thing. Like you know what I mean? Yeah. Spur of the moment, like, mm -hmm. what shoes to get, Yeah. this and that, what I'm low on, what sizes, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. But my main focus be new releases, mm -hmm. and then... Like when people come in and sell shoes, mm -hmm. I, I verify and make sure they're authentic, and then you know we'll work on the price and we'll get that if it's a work if it's like worth getting. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Because a lot of shoes people be trying to get rid of is just shoes that they know you know what I'm saying they ain't really holding no weight no way. Yeah. You know everybody in the resale game. Yeah. Hell, even the people in the retail stores in the resale game. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You can go in you can go in Hibbs or something. And, they be like, yeah, man, I get them to you for like, you know, mm -hmm. woody woody. And he be like, dang, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. But what we trying to do, you know, is trying to keep it going, but keep it going, keep it going. But it get hard as a reseller too, though. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? No, no hate intended, but you know what I'm saying? It really do get hard, bro, because you got a lot of competition. You do. I mean, then you got people that come in here with shoes expecting you to pay four, five hundred dollars for the shoe. But then you be like, how could I make money off of that? Right. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They they trying to sell it to you for what they know it go mm -hmm. for, which mm -hmm. is part of the game. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's fair game. It is what it is on yeah. that. Because I ain't got to say, yeah. No, nah, you don't. <laughs> you know what yeah. I'm saying? But yeah. I ain't going to say no if it's worth it. You exactly. know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, these right here definitely worth it, man. For Stuff sure. like this, that's definitely worth it. For you sure. You know what I mean? Like, but it's a lot of people that's into the sneakers right now, which in the younger generation, they don't even know what these is. Nah, they don't. They don't know what them are, man. Yeah. These you know is saying? like, if you see somebody with some 18s on, you know, you got to look. I looked, I was, I looked a couple of times. Yeah. Like when you see them, you got to look. You got to know. Them came out in a package. Uh, they At one point. Yes, yeah, sir. That was coming out in a suitcase and everything mm -hmm. with the brush kit and all that. And the brush kit. Man, yeah. these came out when we was in school too, man. Like, yeah. I had these, the 17s. Mm -hmm. I even had the um, ones kind of looked like spaceship shoes. They were blue up here on the toe. 
Uh, with the glove on the top. Man, I had them 15s. Joints. I think that yeah. was called 15. Yeah, they might have yeah. been. Nah, they had one of the 15s. I got 15s in here. Uh, I think them might have been the, the 19s. They might have been 19s. 19s. Okay. Because I know the 20s was the scrap around the angle. The 20, I can't never find. Like, Man, I can't, I can't find, find those 20s, 20s right? Bro. But guess what? I'm finna look them up, bro. Yeah. I gotta find them. I I'll believe pay I can for get them, them because nobody got them. I never see no twenties. You get what I'm saying? Like yeah. I would literally put the twenties in here, and that's yeah. what I'm saying. That's the yeah. whole motive of the game to be ahead. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Not catching up. Like you gotta really be ahead of folks, man. Yeah. If you got stuff that's worth getting, people gonna definitely come mm -hmm. get it. You know what yeah. I mean? So yeah, it's definitely that's a good up. a good feel, man. That I chose. It's a game like it don't get muddy like. The street game, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. It, it, yeah. With this, the bad, the worst thing that can happen to this, this game is somebody, you know what I'm saying, spraying rumors in line. True. You feel me? Which I don't get into none of that. Like, I don't even talk about folks, bro. Like, ain't no reason for it. There's no that, reason you know to. Man, yeah. everybody hustling is room for everybody. Yeah. Just everybody do what you eat. do. What's yeah. for you is for you. Yeah. Well, ain't, ain't, you know what I mean? Exactly. Speaking so, of that, so I know I heard you talk about the podcast set up. Like, what other goals you got? Business-wise, you know, like multiple locations or like how big you trying to. Try but I'm to actually trying to expand. I'm definitely trying to expand. That's that's always number one. But number two, I'm trying to monopolize too. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I really mm -hmm. want to be in several locations. Okay. You know what I mean? So <clears throat> I'm definitely um, looking into in here right now, looking into um, the sneaker cleaning service part. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So I figured that part out here. Shortly because I got a full section in the back where I can wash sneakers, do all this and that. Okay. Then I got a section back here that's like a dressing room. It's a dressing room area. I got three dressing rooms. Okay. But I'm thinking about changing them okay. into something else. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Not really sure what just yet, but I got yeah. some goals though. I'm finna sure. handle, man. I got a lot of, a lot of stuff in in this brain, man. Yeah. <laughs> I try not to say too much of it. Cause you can't really put it out there like for sure. that. You gotta keep yeah, you know, somebody else to grab. You know for what I mean? Sure. For sure. I got some stuff I'm gonna do though. You still doing your clothing line too? Like you still yeah, selling your clothing line here? Yeah, my brand right over there, man. Okay. Got his own section. Okay. Um, definitely still doing Mozilla. Okay. I ain't gonna stop doing that. That's another thing, you know. Shit, this this right here, one baby itself, but that's another baby too. For sure. Shit, I gotta come up with the designs. Mm -hmm. Then I gotta make them, you know what I'm saying, make the merch. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I don't really pay nobody to make mine because I, I got everything that's needed. You know For what I sure. mean? Yeah. But uh everything in house. Everything in house yeah. so far. But this time, this go around though, I'm gonna reach out. I'm gonna actually get out of here uh -huh. and let somebody else take care of that for me. Okay. You know what I mean? For sure. So you can move yeah, around. So I can, yeah, so I can move around and do yeah. what I need to do. You yeah. know what I mean? So so how do people, if they want to keep up with, you know, new products or just in general follow you, what social media do you have? All right, we got a, uh, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> we got, I got IG, which is Touchdown1201. Okay. I got a um, website, which is www.touchdown1201.com. Mm -hmm. Then, uh, of course, Facebook, Touchdown Kicks and Fits. Kicks and Fits is spelled with a Z at the end. Okay. All right. Um, let me see. Yeah, that's that's what I got right now. Okay. I got, um, we cover IG, yeah. I, okay. So we're I'm working on the, my Twitter. We're going to get the YouTube running with the pod. When we get the podcast, yeah. we'll get the YouTube set up. And that we'll, part. We'll put that on now. So, yep. Yeah. Well, shit, appreciate you yes, sitting sir, down bro. with me, bro. Yes, yeah, sir. No doubt, man. I appreciate yeah, yeah. you coming, man. For sure. Anything sure. else you want to Want to man. say or? Hey man, y'all stay tuned. This may be one of the biggest things that ever happened in history. Straight up, it's this thing might be bigger than what we all can imagine. For sure. Just keep, hey, keep rocking with me. Keep supporting. You know what I'm saying? I'm thankful for everybody. Mm -hmm. Hey, if you got a dream, chase it. Chase it for real. It's so much better being an entrepreneur. For sure.